So, how did the giant electric car manufacturers seize this unique chance? Faced with this rare opportunity, Tesla, the world's leading electric vehicle corporation, has also seized this important opportunity by collaborating with China battery cell supplier Cattle since it unveiled its sodium-ion battery, along with a solution that could integrate the cells within lithium-ion batteries in a single pack. The sodium-ion cells are a more cost-effective option than the lithium-ion batteries, opening the door for lower prices in the EV battleground market in China. The cattle chairman, Zheng Yongun, highlighted the favorable characteristics of utilizing sodium ion cells during the company's online launch event. Sodium ion batteries have unique advantages in low temperature performance, fast charging, and environmental adaptability, Zheng said. Moreover, they are compatible and complementary with lithium ion batteries. Diversified technical routes are an important guarantee for the long term development of the industry. Cattle's worked with Tesla since Gigafactory Shanghai started producing vehicles in late 2019. Tesla started customer deliveries in early 2020 at the Chinese plant and has relied on Cattle's world-class battery manufacturing to keep up with growing demand in China. According to statistics, in 2023, Cattle sold 158 gigawatt hours of batteries for light electric vehicles, an increase of 56.5% over the same period of 2022. In the first half of last year alone, Cattle battery sales reached 139 billion yuan, accounting for 74% of the company's total revenue for the year. Analysts have estimated cattle could sell more than 500 gigawatts of batteries in 2023, a growth of more than 40% compared to 2022. At that time, the company had a 30% market share, but the company has been struggling with a rising cost of lithium carbonate and nickel, which increased twofold. As a result, the production process has met loads of difficulties. Despite the sodium ion cell's reputation for somewhat lower energy density, Cattle said its research and development team had reached an energy density of 160 watt hours per kilogram, and it should exceed 200 watt hours per kg in the coming years as more experimentation continues. For comparison, lithium ion cells can reach about 285 watt hours a kg, according to K.M. Abraham, a research professor at Northeastern University. Interestingly, the solution cattle also unveiled at the event is also expected to compensate for the reduced energy density of the sodium ion cell, while preserving the advantage the cell makeup has to offer. After the news of this new cell shot, Tesla stock rose over 4.6% at that time Tesla stock traded at $677.07, up $30.23. Then, it said that sodium ion batteries will become the optimal choice for the whole EV industry, as if the starting price of an electric vehicle powered by lithium ion with a capacity of 50 kilowatt hours is about $30,000 to $45,000, like the Chevrolet Bolt EV 2023 is $31,000. Nissan Leaf 2023 is $32,000, and Tesla Model 3 Standard Range Plus 2023 costs $46,990. The price of an electric car powered by sodium ion batteries with similar capacity is only about $25,000. Thus, this helps customers save at least $5,000 to $10,000. It would not be an exaggeration to say that in the electric car war, cheaper batteries win. A cattle representative said that it's difficult for a young business to keep up with the game, but they are ahead in innovation and focusing on promoting the ability to convert R&D achievements to mass production. With about 18,000 researchers and a budget for R&D activities doubled compared to last year, Cattle is showing determination to continuously break through to become the leader in the electric vehicle battery market as sodium ion batteries become a battery line that's expected to create a new technological breakthrough. BYD, on the other hand, is also an equally typical example of China's dominance in electric vehicle battery production. With the backing of Warren Buffett, Wang Xuan Fu's BYD controlled up to 15% of the market share, supplying domestic businesses and competitors operating right in China. The production capacity is forecast to increase from 42 gigawatt hours per year in 2023 to 186 gigawatt hours a year in 2030, enough to power the 4.6 million electric vehicles produced each year in this land. How does sodium ion battery attract strong attention from various fields? Have you ever wondered what materials your phone and computer batteries are made out of? If not yet, that's okay. We'll take you to the next area where sodium ion batteries are likely to lead next year, which is the market for manufacturing portable electronic devices. 
Sodium ion batteries are emerging as an alternative to lithium ion. Then, not only famous lithium battery companies like Cattle, BYD, and Reliance Industries, but also enormous electric vehicle device manufacturers like Samsung, LG, or Apple might be determined to bring this tomorrow's technology out of the lab and into mass production. Amid skyrocketing prices and predicted shortages of lithium ion battery materials, sodium ion batteries have never been more interesting for these producers. Surprisingly, according to research, a smartphone using a sodium ion battery can provide up to 30% longer talk time than models using traditional lithium ion batteries. This can attract user interest and create positive competition in the portable market. Furthermore, sodium ion batteries also play an important role in developing a smart and sustainable power grid by storing renewable energy from solar and wind sources when output exceeds current demand. This helps weather variability and fluctuations in renewable energy production while reducing pressure on the grid. By storing excess energy in sodium ion batteries, pressure on the grid can be reduced, helping the grid system operate more efficiently. This prevents overload and reduces the risk of network failures. A report by the International Renewable Energy Agency shows that the use of sodium ion batteries and other energy storage technologies can reduce the cost of storing energy from solar and wind sources to as low as 50 cents per kilowatt hour by 2030, compared to the current average about 10 US dollars per kilowatt hour. This demonstrates the great potential of sodium ion batteries in creating a smart and sustainable grid by reducing costs and increasing the flexibility of renewable energy storage systems. What obstacles do sodium ion batteries have to overcome before becoming champions in the battery industry? Despite being on the verge of commercialization and getting a warm welcome from consumers, first sodium ion batteries still have to overcome a number of challenges. First and foremost, that is the ability to store electricity. Although up to 17 businesses in the EV industry have planned to use this battery line for their products, the problem of storing electricity is still at a deadlock. However, sodium ion batteries or any other battery type on the market will hardly cause cattle to lose its throne. Sodium ion batteries are predicted to segment the electric vehicle battery market as they are mainly used for mid-range electric vehicles, which don't have high demand for charge storage capacity, but it's more than adequate for urban commuting and short trips, while solid-state batteries will focus on the luxury car segment. Expert Shirley Meng of the University of Chicago believes that these two battery lines will create the next development step for electric vehicle batteries. Particularly, the latest announcements from several battery manufacturers mention an energy density of 160 watt-hours per kilogram for this battery, while 200 watt-hours per kilogram is their next milestone. While these numbers are comparable to some lower-end lithium-ion batteries, they are still behind other lithium-ion batteries, such as Tesla batteries at 250 watt-hours a kilogram. Another challenge is that the establishment of the supply chain, achieving financial benefits based on an abundant supply of materials but limited technologies, is an initial challenge for manufacturers when starting to exploit this fertilized market. Sodium ion batteries show a lot of promise and could become a good alternative for specific applications. So if you're ready to help ease supply chain bottlenecks and accelerate the energy transition, please comment ready to let us know in the comments down below. We hope you'll have the most relaxing feeling after watching this video. If you did, please hit the like button and join the Tesla Car World family by subscribing to our channel. And don't miss out on any of our awesome videos by hitting the bell icon. We value your feedback and your time. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you soon. Until then, stay safe and have fun.